Hello everyone, my name is Master Rolfus and welcome to Planetary Annihilation. Today we have a- Oh, that's not my commander. Hold on a second. There we go. There's my commander right down there. Ah, near the lake of the Nile planet. So this is a three for street. And we got shared eco, we got shared armies, all that good stuff, as you can probably tell. Now, I've asked one person to go on Alamo and he's going to be chilling out all by himself. So it's up to me and, uh... My commander ally over here, who's using the Aurelius Commander to kind of um, dominate Nile, and then afterwards we can go on to the Metal Planet. Yeah, you can choose a Metal Planet spawn, but hopefully because Nile has a lot more resources, the enemy will come to us and blah 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 and all that stuff. Honestly, I'm having a bad luck with Planetary Annihilation games tonight, mostly because late at night Planetary Annihilation games tend to become the wild wild west. You get systems where they're... um. There are just too many planets, or there are planets that are, like, massive, like, 1300 radius in a five-planet system with only, like, five players, and you're just like, wait, what the fuck? Why why does this work? Why why make this work? And usually the answer is... Basically, fuck you. Um... Then I was in this other game where... We kind of gave the opponents... A planet by himself and because of that he was just able to dominate and my white ally not never recovered poor white ally just get it he just got uh, shit hammered over and over and over again honestly I played very poorly in that game as well like I I overestimated my allies abilities and I underestimated um, my opponents abilities and stuff like that like, ultimately, planetary annihilation becomes a lot harder once you, uh, own a planet. Once you're bursting off against, against someone who owns an entire planet by himself. And then there was this one game where I was just, like, stuck between two players. That wasn't fun. And yeah, I'm building a lot of fabricators. I'm mostly expecting this to be kind of like a lonely fucking, uh, planet. That sort of stuff. Spawns are far apart to the point where I don't have to worry too much about shit. There's a huge amount of, like, frames drop going on. I've noticed that with all of my uh, Planetary Annihilation games. It's a little bit crazy, to say the least. Um, hopefully that changes. It's not really changing fast enough, which kind of, like, irritates me a little bit. Let's check out if there's someone over there on the other side of the Nile. And maybe on his side as well. We'll be a good sport about it. Help him out a little bit. There's nobody on this goddamn planet besides me and my purple compadre over here. Then we'll go ahead and help out our ally on Alamo. Okay, thank you for the pink. Um, let me go ahead and get a tier 2 bot factory out heard a lot about tier 2 bots being like really good so we'll see we'll see okay no enemy on this planet which is good but also bad it begs the question of where is the enemy like who's your daddy and what does he do and all that type of shit you know no there's nobody there what how could there be someone there no, it's the one. Just expand. Just keep expanding. And our eco can really support a lot now. Usually I'm the one making the mistakes in the storage department, but now it's all of us, so let's just go ahead and get some storage right now. I will go and get myself a tier 2 air factory out. I feel as though our ally is against three people, which is kind of bad, kind of bad. Should help him out as soon as possible. He's doing pretty well, considering that Teal was currently not giving him much of a fight. Foxes are continuing to kick some butt. They possibly also all spawned on the metal planet, that's also something else. So we own Nile, they own uh, the Metal Planet. Um, 
We have more eco, but they have the ability to destroy us. So it's a trade that I'm not necessarily in a position to really call fair. It's just my own forte. My own opinion on that little subject. Uh, I probably used forte incorrectly, but that's okay. Alright, I'm sending over some reinforcements. And hopefully with more docks, he can eventually win. Yes, we are all alone on the Nile. Which is why I'm going to do this. And why I'm also doing um, this. Arise, my advanced air fabber, arise! Just keep sending over the guys. I got more dudes. Oh, okay. That's why I disconnected it. Well, that's okay. I'll just send over guys anyway. What the fuck? What the fuck? What the beep boop bop is going on? Why are my dudes in the middle of, in the, like, the bottom of the ocean? That's crazy. That's crazy talk. That's a witchcraft right there. I just have 11 locusts doing nothing. I'm just gonna keep building them up and wait. Uh, we need metal now. Desperately need metal now. So that's why I'm gonna build some. My ally has not done a good job of getting metal. Go, go get these. What are you doing? You get. I send these guys down to claim that metal. Uh. Ch -ch 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 -ch. More power too. I'll have to send out my locust swarm. I'm gonna wait till they get to like a massive amount, like 20 or something. Something stupid. Are you serious? Who canceled that? You not see the buckets of eco we're making? Buckets, I say. No, we're actually our eco's doing pretty well now. What the hell is going on? Disconnected? Oh, I guess the guy's reconnecting and disconnecting. I don't know. I guess that's the norm of the day, I suppose. This is the Wild Wild West of Planetary Annihilation, so expect a lot of uh, disconnects. A lot of disconnects and brouhaha. Let's watch the locusts. Whoosh. Away, my swarm, away. Boy, it wasn't lagging so much when it comes to movement. Let's do build a torpedo launcher. That's savage. A swarm, a tear, it moves, it consumes all. It's 
beautiful. It's beautiful. It's marvelous. Yeah, we practically won this. Like, I, I can't imagine this being a a stunning victory for the enemy team. Do we not have orbital vision? That's a problem. Yeah, they're right over there. We know that they're on the metal planet. Well, how advanced are they on the metal planet? We'll never know until we check it out. keep calling teleporters warp gates and I'm just like hmm I want to correct them but I also don't want to do it and time now to get more tier 2 energy Suppose we can also get more energy storage. I need more locusts. I need more. More. I also need more metal. More. More. We need more. We must consume more. You can kind of just chill right there. You can chill right there. Uh, let's see. Here, go for that. Okay, marvelous work. We have enough energy storage to last us till, I don't know, fucking winter. See, guys, I do make energy storage. Sometimes. The situation is relevant, I suppose. It took him away. Took one away. It wasn't me. It definitely wasn't me. Yeah, I have proof of this. I actually stopped my commander from doing any shenanigans. Whoa! Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa. Some savagery is going on. Come on. I really want to hook it up. Unleash the swarm. Consume all. Well, that wasn't as successful as I thought it would be. Oh, well, you know what that means? Just gotta build more.
And he said to the man, run in the stand. Hey, bum, bum, bum. Got any grapes? Bum, bum, bum. My locust only strategy will work. I promise you this, my friends. In fact, locusts for life. We need more. We need more. If you believe in the locust god, it shall happen. Yeah, having these like groupies kind of like continuously make me more and more locusts is a dream come true. Look at this. Ultimately, I am not sure if it is a good idea to do this locust strategy. I'm not sure if man is ready to play God, but you know what? I'm willing to test it. He said fuck with a capital F. Fire! Send them more vermin. And we have a backup plan coming in anyway. At this point I have too many resources. I must be stopped. Alright, I think we're finished up with um, tier 2 metal and stuff. Go forth! <laughs> have you ever seen a swarm of 90 locusts before? I haven't, but it shall be glorious. The dark gods cometh, and they bring about the locust swarm. The locust swarm! Let your insides be one with the locust god. Did you want more locusts? Now you get more. Look at the beauty. Look at the beauty, the majesty of a purple ooze monster eating away at everything. That was an inverted turret. That's a little bit weird. Now what we really need, right, are more locust hordes. Get away. Fire! Fire the swarm. The swarm. It expands and thrives off the consumption of materials. Oh, what a lame-o. I should have deleted the Haley actually. Oh well, GG. No re- See you guys next time, bye bye
And sorry for like the short game, but listen, guys, it's like 12:09 a.m. You're not gonna get a good game at 12:09 a.m. Bye, bye, bye.